It's the English Summer here and welcome back to another part of Stardew Valley. So I have actually played, I think I played two days off screen in which I was just working on our money and stuff. I was, um, yeah, kind of just collecting things around our farm and I really wanted to get some money in the bank. I do want to get a backpack. We are on 1,800 at the minute. So we're not doing too, too badly. I kind of don't want to get those geodes just yet because that will waste money and I am trying to save but basically loads of you guys were like why don't you just save up oh and also I added in a path and we have a dog news Marnie brought around a dog so now we have a dog that's just chilling in our farm which is great you don't even have to like pay to feed it Dear Molly, tomorrow we're holding the egg festival in the town square. You should arrive between 9 and 2 if you'd like to attend. You wouldn't want to miss the annual egg hunt. Yeah, buddy, we get an egg hunt. So we'll either do that in this part or the next part. I haven't really decided how long this part's going to be or anything. But let's just water our crops for now. But yeah, quite a lot happened off screen. As you can see, Marnie brought us a dog, you know, he was kind of just sat outside our farm and she was like, would you like him? And I was like, hell yeah, I'm a dog lover. I'm gonna take the dog off your hands. She is called Polly. I don't know why I called him boy, but she's called Polly. She's a girl. She's super cute and I love her. She's the cutest. And yeah, like I was saying, you don't have to pay to feed your dogs or anything. None of these are ready. Uh, maybe we should go get some more crops. I kind of want to change up my farm a little bit. I saw a really cool farm online and I kind of want to go for it. Oh wow, these add different sounds in. They sound better. Um, but yeah, I really want to try and like work on our farm's aesthetic as a whole, I guess you could say. But what we did get was a journal entry. You received a letter from the local wizard. He claims to have information regarding the old community center. We have to enter the wizard's tower. So I'm guessing this is the wizard's tower. I don't really know how we get there. Um, yeah, I freaking have no idea how we get there, but we're gonna try it. I'm guessing we go down through like Marnie's. So that's the way we're gonna go but I don't know if we'll be able to make it. Uh, also, I got some money. Um, Robin lost her axe and I found it for her because I am a lovely person. As you can still, we si still have like loads of resources over there that we can um, scout out and stuff. But yeah, I'm gonna try and get to this wizard's house. Let's go. Let's go. <gasps> Who's this? Hello. Oh. I'll have new items every week, so make sure you come back. I've never seen this woman before in my life, but these are hella expensive. Why would you want to buy slime? What's it actually used for? I don't know. I sold all of mine. Whoops. A rare seed. <gasps> Imagine if you bought that and it was like, here's a pineapple. I don't know why it would be a pineapple, but imagine if that's what it was. Like, you'd be gutted. You paid like a thousand pounds for it and you could only sell it for like one pound. That would be really annoying. So here is the wizard's tower. Let's go speak to the wizard. Hello? Ah, come in. Okay. Ooh. Hey dude, I like your hat. I am Raz... Rasmodus. Rasmodus? Is that how you pronounce that? I don't know. I'm gonna call him Raz. Seeker of the arcane truths, mediary between physical and ethereal, master of the seven elements, keeper of the sacred ch- You get the point. Yes, I do get the point. You have many titles. And you, Molly, the one whose arrival I have long foreseen. He's foreseen me before. Here, I'd like to show you something. What, what would you like to show me? Behold! <gasps> Oh, it's the little green dude! Ooh. Ooh. He's making funny noises. Ooh. You've seen one before, haven't you? Yes. They call themselves the Junimos. Mysterious spirits. These ones, for some reason, they refuse to speak with me. Ooh. 
I'm not sure why they've moved into the community center, but you have no reason to fear them. Mm, you sure about that? Oh, we told him about the plaque. Hmm, you found a golden scroll written in an unknown language. Most interesting. Stay here. I'm going to see for myself. I'll return shortly. Bye, Raz. See you, mate. Tick tock. Oh! He scared us. Raz, don't do that to me. Don't sneak on mommy. Girl's got a weak heart. I found the note. The language is obscure, but I was able to decipher it. We, the Junimo, are happy to aid you. In return, we ask for gifts of the valley. If you are one with the forest, then you will see the true nature of this scroll. Oh, we're clearly not one with the forest yet. We need to get in one with the forest. Hmm, one with the forest. What do they mean? Sniff, sniff. <laughs> Sorry guys, you probably didn't want to hear me sniff. Oh, that actually hurt my nose. Aha! You found something, dude? Come here! Okay. I'm scared. This guy's crazy. My cauldron is bubbling with ingredients from the forest. Baby fern, moss grub, caramel top toadstool. toadstool. Can you smell it? Here, drink up. Let the essence of the forest permeate your... Whatever that said, I clicked too fast. Girl, you don't drink random things that a random wizard gives to you. Unless the wizard's like Dumbledore. Dude! Oh no, everything's turning green. <gasps> we have the essence of the forest. We are at one with the forest, guys. This is how LSD feels. Okay. Should I skip this? <laughs> I kind of don't want to. It's kind of really relaxing. Is that it? You've gained the power of the forest magic. Now you can decipher the true meaning of the Junimo scrolls. Do we go back to the... I'm guessing we go back to the place then. Because... We now have the power. We got the power. So yeah, we have the power of the forest within. Yes. Let's do some fishing first though. I am actually terrible at fishing in this game. Hence why I plugged in, if I can grab it. I plugged in my Xbox controller because I find it a little bit easier to do fishing with this bad boy. So uh, we're going to do some fishing. Let's do it. So we just wait for the fishies to come at us. Come at me, bro. This might vibrate though, so apologies if my uh, microphone picks it up. Don't worry, it's not me farting or anything. It's just the vibrations of the control. So just letting you know, just a forewarning. Yes, we got a hit. But yeah, I definitely find it easier with this. We got a small mouth bass. Sick. Let's go for another one. Fishing actually takes up quite a lot of energy though, not gonna lie. But it's worth it because you can kind of sell things off. We also need to get one piece of coal um, because we still need to make a scarecrow. We really need to get that done. And we need to join the guild. I'm not really sure how you go about that though. Kind of should have googled it before this part. Dude, this is so hard! Dude, stop going down, you little shite! Stop it! Stay there! No! Stay there! Oh my god, why are you moving so much? You're a pain in the ass, my friend. Come on, we almost got you. Dude! Just stay in one place. It's not even worth it. It was only a bass. Oh, for God's sakes. Are you kidding me? Right. I'm just going to continue playing with my control for a little bit. Because I can. 
Boom! I didn't even know that you could play with the control, to be honest. Um, then I found out and I was like, sick! Let's get some fiber. Some fiber in our diet, make us go to the toilet, you know? All that good stuff. Why not? Why not go for some fiber? Oi, get here. Get here, stone! Uh, fiber actually sells for like one piece of gold every bit of fiber you get. But there is so much freaking fiber and you get mixed seeds from it, which is really cool because they can pretty much create anything, which is always good when we're trying to make some money from crops. But yeah, I've started using the box more because loads of you guys were saying you may as well just use the box and it levels you up really quick. Hey, Sam. Hey, buddy. Let's talk to... Oi. Sam's trying to do a kickflip. Okay, that means he won't want to speak to us. Whatever. Boys and their toys. Granny! George spends the whole day in front of that darn television set. I wish he'd go outside more. Some fresh air would do him good. She's always talking about flipping George. Granny, at some point in life, you have to stop worrying about what other people do with their lives and you have to start living your own, you know? You just gotta live your own life. Do it. Oh, we got a clam. I want to pick you up. I tend to just go with my uh, cursor for that one. <laughs> oh, what do we use to get these guys out? Oh, they gave us stones. I didn't want stones, worms. I wanted something good. But you gave me stones. I can already get those. Let's do some more fishing, even though I am terrible. Actually, we have way too much stuff in our inventory so uh i want to go give granny this clam i feel as if because she likes the beach you know she'd be a fan of a, a clam maybe i don't know granny i have a present for you would you like it granny it smells awful oh well sorry evelyn freaking woman who told me that she liked the sea air and stuff doesn't like the smell of clams. Whatever. I was trying to be nice. No more presents for grandma. Here I was thinking she was all sweet, you know. She's a sweet old lady. She's gonna like any gift that I give her. No. Incorrect. Did we do all of our plants today? Did we water them all? I think we did. Uh, whoa. I forgot we had a dog for a second there. Uh, let's plant these bad boys and water them. There you go. We watered it. And let's go stick some things in here. No. Put them in there. Yep. Throw them in there. Throw the fiber in there. And let's go put the wood and stuff in our chest. I should probably move the chest outside. I also put a chest up, um near the i didn't want to do that near the uh what am i doing can we i don't know how you interact with stuff i'm gonna go back to using the mouse because it's kind of easier um but yeah i put a um chest outside the mining area so that when we mine and we get stuff like in our inventory we can um kind of just throw it all in there instead of always having to go back to our house which I thought was a better idea um yeah so that's what I did loads of you guys were suggesting that and I thought it was a brilliant idea so thanks chumps for helping me out on that one you guys you guys are the best hey Leah it's simpler to be friends with the trees they don't have much to say everyone's like telling me the same stuff over and over Oh no, mum's making lentil soup tonight. I'm guessing he doesn't like lentil soup. I don't know you. You do. I've spoken to you before, but that's cool. If you dig in the dirt, you can find some interesting things. One time I found a really old piece of pottery. I bought it to Gunther and he said it was over a thousand years old. Well, we don't have a shovel. Uh. Oh, we could probably go upgrade our tools, actually. Hey, Elliot, my boy. The fresh air of this valley is good for the body and mind. A quick stroll always invigorates me. We need to try and get on his good side. We need to give him um, some gifts that he might like. But let's go fishing. Let's try this. Let's go over this side. Let's go fishing off here. Let's go for it. 
All right, we're ready. <laughs> we got a lot of energy. So, we oh, you can't go fishing off there? That's cool, I guess. Let's go fishing off here then. <laughs> oh, we got oh, broken glasses. Nice. Not really any use that they're broken, you know, but kind of cool. <laughs> cool, I guess. All right. I'm so bad at this. Okay, there we go. That was a little bit better, but we only got a sardine. Well, that's rubbish. We need to get up our fishing skill. Like, quite a lot. Come on. There we go. Another hit. Come on, dude. Yeah. A herring? Okay. It's a little bit better than a sardine, I guess. It's not as small. Might get a little bit more money for it. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. We got away. That fish will always be known as the one that got away. I'm terrible at fishing. If someone would like to come over and do all my fishing for me, that would be great, you know. I'm good at fishing in real life, I just can't do it on this freaking game. I kind of wish it was just like Animal Crossing in which you could just like uh, not go through this hellhole. Because they all keep getting away because I am terrible. Actually the worst. <laughs> <gasps> oh my goodness. We should have bought some more seeds today. That would have been a good thing to do. But I am trying to save up. Hopefully we'll have 2,000 so we can get a backpack in the next part. Or in this part, depending on how long it's been. Have all the fish gone to sleep? We got soggy newspaper. Nice. That'll come in really handy. You know, I've always wanted a bit of soggy newspaper. Not gonna lie. Come on. We need some coal. How do you get coal? Can you just get that from there? Uh, smashing rocks. Another pair of bro broken glasses. Who the hell needs broken glasses? Can we just give them to Gunther? <laughs> Are they an artifact? They should be. I keep thinking- Oh my goodness. Are you freaking kidding me? I think all the fish are asleep. Let's go. Let's get out of here. Because they're all annoying me. Right. Let's go. I don't know where we're gonna go. I'm guessing we can just get coal from uh, using the pickaxe on the stones. So maybe, why am I going in the graveyard? I do not want to be in here, especially not at 9 p.m. at night. Let's go to the saloon and talk, to, actually CBA talking to people. Hey guys, Robin has a hot temper. Oh my God, they all keep saying the same things to me. Like I need to start becoming better friends with people, but that's just far too much of an effort. <laughs> I need to find out what they like. I might just look at the cheat sheet, to be honest, and uh, get like cooking up some stuff. But we should probably try and get some coal. I don't know if we'll definitely be able to though. Uh, let's put, right, we're putting the soggy newspaper in. Uh, it looks like someone lost their glasses, they're busted. I'm just gonna put all of them in there because I don't think we'll need them. If we do, apologies. <laughs> if we do, I'm sure you guys will let me know in the comments section, <laughs> but they just seem like junk to me. Uh, okay. We aren't finding any coal as of yet. Um, right, there's loads of rocks down here though. So, Oh, we got one piece. That's all we really need to make a thingy actually. So let's head back up to our house. We already got, um, we already got everything else we need for a scarecrow. So let's head back in here. Look, our doggy's here. Hey, Polly, how have you, how have you had, what? Have you had a good day is what I was meant to say. Right, let's craft this scarecrow. We got, oh, are you kidding me? We need four more wood. Are you freaking kidding me? You know what? I'm gonna chop down the tree because I can. Let's go for it. Oi, let me chop you down. Oh, what are they doing? Here we go. We're gonna get it. Yeah, boy. I'll take all of your wood. And let's go back in. 
I should just chop down more trees, to be honest, because it gives you, like, so much wood. Right, let's craft this. What am I doing? Uh, crafting. Scarecrow! Woohoo! We got one. We got a scarecrow. And we get 100G for it. <gasps> yes, that means we're going to have 2,000 when we wake up tomorrow, which is awesome. But guys, I think I'm going to leave this part here. It's probably been a little bit on the shorter side, but we did a full day's work. Like, I'm actually pretty impressed. And tomorrow is the Easter festival, so I kind of want to spend the whole day doing that and exploring that. So I will speak to you guys when we are celebrating the little Easter egg hunt type thing, which is so cool. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you like this video, please do give it a big thumbs up. I don't know what that face was, but if you liked it, give it a thumbs up. Leave the comments and suggestions and everything else like that down below because they really help me. And I will speak to you all in the next part. Bye, guys.